Hey yarn friends, welcome back to Mama Mama Kayla's Yarn Tube. I'm Kayla and welcome to my crazy life. <laughs> I'm really, really late in the day getting this filmed and I don't even know if I'm going to stay up and get it uploaded tonight. I might just do that in the morning um, because it is really late. This morning I got up and ran to town to try to get my last gift bought that I was trying to find in town online but it kept saying the stores were out of it and it wouldn't be delivered till like January and so um and I could order it on Amazon but it wasn't a, you know even with Prime you don't know that it's going to get here because everything's running kind of slow and it's an item that I thought I could just pick up in town it's for Big Daddy and so um Dakota got online and found it somewhere in town and so I had to get up early to go um, get that this morning and then while I was going to town someone broke into the house next door during the daytime now um, they actually broke in about between 10 and 11 a.m. broke into the house next door and stole things and came over to our house and was looking in the window now the guys were here let's see who was here Jody was here and um, Dakota was here, but they were uh, asleep at the time and didn't know what was going on. But when I got back home, um, I looked at the cameras, we have security cameras, and it, you know, showed that somebody came and that um, they was looking in our windows and they went next door and pulled their truck up in front of the house next door and stole things. The thing is, though, it was raining, and so they stole things and put in the back of their truck in the rain. And so some of the things they took out of that house were made of particle board, and they put them in the back of their truck in the rain. So, I don't know, that wasn't very bright. <laughs> they weren't very bright thieves. Plus, um, our home has security cameras all the way around it. They're not hidden. They're seen very well. I mean, you can see... Just by standing, walking up to the front of my house, you see three security cameras right there. <clears throat> but I don't know. They and so the house next door is owned by my parents. Jody's mom. It was Jody's mom's home, and then she decided she wanted to move um, down south with one of Jody's brothers, and so my parents ended up buying the house just so she could move. And so the house is empty. No one lives there at one time. They did let someone live there for a few months. It didn't work out well. So um, the house has been empty all this time for years and years and years. That house has been empty. It's just some things in the house that, um, you know, nobody really cares about. It's not, not good things or anything like that. <coughs> so it's, it wasn't really a big deal that somebody stole things out of the house. It's just, you know, a big deal that they had the nerve to steal things out of the house in the daytime. Plus, come over to my home and look in the windows. That's a big deal, and that's very concerning for us. Um, but anyway, when I got home and figured that out and everything, the rest of the day was spent dealing with that. So that's why I never got around to filming my video earlier today. Long story. <laughs> Okay, so today is my day 16 of Vlogmas, and I want to show you how lovely this blanket is. Here's where my purple ended. It almost got to that corner, and I love purple. I, I, I guess you all know this. Most of you know, unless you're new, that, you know, I've said several times that I had, um, I've had purple hair for years and years and years. I had purple hair. Right now, I just have gray hair, <clears throat> but I love purple. Most people think purple is my favorite color, but it is one of my favorite colors, but I think my favorite color is yellow. <clears throat> but anyway, I do love purple. Most people assume it is my favorite color because I had purple hair for so long. But I just love this. I love it. I can't wait to see what color is next, so let's check it out. Ah, this will be beautiful pop. This will. I don't know if Terry like lined up her colors and you know um, thought about the process. I personally did not, Terry. 
I was lucky the balls even made it into the bag. The morning that I mailed your package was not a good morning for me health-wise. And so Elijah was helping me get it together so we could get to the post office and get it mailed. And so I just had no idea how what the order of the balls went in the bag. It's totally random. But I just wonder if Terry kind of planned this out a little bit because the colors just are amazing together. But anyway, the next color is going to be red. Very bright red. That will give it just the pop that it needs there. I love that. So red will start right here and come around. I'm so excited about that. I think that red just will give it a great big bright pop. Thank you, Terry, so much. I love that. I love doing the swap with Terry. And so the swap is with Terry at Yarn Joy Podcast. If you hadn't checked out her videos, go over to her channel. The link will be below in the description box. So you can check out Terry's channel and see how her rectangle scrappy blanket is coming along. She is on whatever today's date is. That's the Vlogmas that she is on. I'm behind because I'm on Vlogmas 16. But um, I don't even know what today's date is. But Terry is on that date. <laughs> But anyway, um, and I'm just going to keep going. Like after, I'll still be about three or four days behind on Christmas. And so I'm just going to keep going the next few days with my Vlogmas. Because I'm going to work on this green rectangle blanket on up until gen in January. Also adding in some of my scrap balls. So um, thanks for watching. I appreciate you all very much. And... Come back soon to find out another edition of my crazy life. <laughs>